Hello and welcome to Let's Play XCOM Chimera Squad with me, Boltish Begammer. Last time, we dealt with the progeny. So that means this time we're facing a new enemy, the Sacred Coil. But first, we have a lot of things to do at base. We are not taking Zephyr. I know Godmother does a lot of damage. But I feel like we're going to need Patchwork's abilities in the upcoming fights against the upcoming enemies. She's a good all-around unit. Patchwork, when did you get in? Not so long ago. What's wrong? I spec'd out a whole workshop for our field office. Which is currently sitting in a warehouse while they finish the building. I'm sorry. I'll be fine. I just need to find a place to tinker. Pick any open floor space. There's so much of it. Okay. Now that we have her, uh, I want her to go on to the next mission because she needs to start getting some experience now. Of the units that we have, I feel like... Terminal really needs more training now, because now that I defeat an enemy, I have access to more training. So let's get on that. We got Modular Arbor done. We need to get another project. I really want to use Verge again one day, but not this time. Right now, Verge gets to continue overseeing production. And I want to use Cherub too, but he, he's got another day. Okay, so uh, what else do we have? Oh, the market. Uh, no, I don't want these. I do have a handful of intelligence, though, so I should use it. Reduce district unrest every Friday. Yeah, that sounds great. Yes. Please. Can I get the same benefit here? Oh, wait, no, no, that's on the third tier thing. That's only if I have... Okay. Can I get the bonus here now? Sure. Since I'm about to do a mission there, let's do that. Investigate the Sacred Coil. An informant spies a Sacred Coil poking around the entrance of an old advent bunker. We need to know why. The secrets in those underground bunkers should remain buried. I disagree. I disagree. They should, like, be handled now, before they're a problem in the future. You don't want to bury your problems for later, but, like... Oh, right, we need to switch items around. Uh... Right, you currently have nothing. You are currently working on stuff so you don't have anything. Who did I just put on... You! Uh, no scope, no rounds. You can have Trank Rounds. You can have a scope, so I can aim a little bit better. Plated Vest. Plunge Swan Armor. Given that she doesn't have the health upgrade, I think that she needs it more than anybody else. But I don't think she'll be shooting a lot. I don't think that she'll be shooting a lot. I think that uh, Claymore will be shooting more than anybody else. So he probably needs a scope and the Trank Rounds more. So let's give him those. And give her the bed kit. So she can kind of be terminal while terminal's training. A little bit. A little bit. Not quite. Alright, now! Now we can go on the mission. It's always good to plan! Welcome to City 31's not-so-hidden Advent Bunker. A witness spotted Sacred Coil poking around down here. If they give you trouble, poke back and poke we shall but first let's poke around and see what we <gasps> a vent snake lady can go in the vents go torque go now what order do we want our people going uh shelter then claim more than patchwork let's try that we can have patchwork work go earlier later uh last unit through receives an extra action point cool successful shots on enemies will crit nice Move in, now! That vent, by the way, was just right next to the door, so it was completely unnecessary. However, its access point benefits are what we need. Androids! As you can see, I cannot spit against the androids! Because they're immune to poison. So let's try to take out this one. Okay, there's a commando there. 
commando there, and another commando there. I cannot see any more androids. So that's good. So let's try to take out the one that's further away. Good. Uh, 94% versus 94%. Well, six and one half dozen of another. And finally, you have bullets and one target. Did, did he go down? No, there's still another enemy. There's still another enemy. Uh, okay, so what can you do? Let's use Chaining Jolt. I got the hostile. Good. Uh, let's see. I cannot get right next to this enemy in order to bind him immediately. If I can bind him, then it will immediately end the encounter, though. Uh, it's a little bit risky. Let's go out in the open and try again with the tongue. I wait. Is, hold on. It's an android. Good to know. I cannot bind androids. We need to crack open your shell. That armor has a weak point. I cannot see the enemy to reposition with them, and I cannot shoot at them. So Soldier has a psionic attack, but he can't use it because it's an android. It has no mind. All right, delay its turn. I wish I had moved to a spot that didn't give it cover, but here we are. Just do this. Good. Sacred Coil is putting up one hell of a fight for an empty bunker. We're missing something. I'm going to contact City Archives. They may have more detailed records than HQ. Give me a sec. Hmm. I mean, it's not empty. There's stuff in it, like th this dropship. Anyway, vent! Uh, let's see. First unit gets extra armor. You know what? Yeah, let's just make Patrick have lots of armor. And the others get more dodge? You know what? Yeah, there's just nothing wrong with this, this entrance at all. Breaching now. We're going in. Okay. What we got? A lot of enemies. Let's see. Commando. Android. Commando. Android. Commando. Okay. Uh, how about a nice little spit? And then I want to take out the androids because I don't like them. Very practically no chance to hit that one, though. Is there one that I can hit? Not really. They're immune to the psionic thing, so I don't think that my Razzle Dazzle will stop them from doing anything. I also want to save it for the last door. Try to take out the damage. Nope, that didn't work. Nope, that didn't work. Oh, they're hunkering. Oh, I don't like this. Not at the least. So let's see. Can I get number two with a tongue pull? If I can, then that's what I'm going to do. Uh, can't, I can't bind them, can I? It didn't seem like I could. All right, so how about number three? I can get number three. I've got you. Or maybe just uh, repositioning them that lets me get them with a poison spit. No, the androids are immune to poison. That's not a good action. 
Just grapple the one I can. Hopefully two doesn't break him out. Oh no! Try that again, if you dare. Uh Alright, let's try reprogramming one of the androids. Let's let's, let's try it. Overloading target. Next time just shoot. No. Oh, I tried. All right, fortunately, this does extra damage against androids, so let's just kill that one. Melting hardware. If you won't be mine, Personal be scrap. Uh, let's see. This will end the turn. Number two is going to die to poison, so I need to worry about number three. Number three is all the way over there. Let's change places with number three, so it will not be number three. Switching. I'm pretty sure that still affects it. Yeah, it's now number five. So now I can just do this. Target gone. Excellent. There's the poison. Wonderful. Uh, so, how about I throw a bomb over here? Shrapnel out. I could detonate that shrapnel. We all could. However, this needs to go first. Drop the target. Uh. Uh. The bomb goes off. It's fine. Sustain the bind. Hostel no longer exists. And good. Right, that shreds the armor, but it's still going to blow up. Knocked a few scales off. Uh, I didn't like that. Don't let it phase you. Who hit the med pack again? I know what sacred coil is after. Would anyone care to guess? All the gremlins I lost in the war? Yeah, a defunct mech repair bay, which, according to these power readings, is currently very funked. Oh. Oh, mechs. Oh, no. Yeah, we don't want them having that. All right, let's see. Uh, Torque can go in there. I like Torque going in the vent. It's good. Uh... Successful attacks on enemies will crit. Okay, that's great. Yeah, let's have Patchwork go first. Then Shelter, then Claymore? No, how about... Claymore, then Shelter? Yeah, this seems... This seems... This might work. Ready to go. Move in, now. What was... This sure is a video game. All right, let's see. Android. Android. Commando. Commando. Android. Purifier. Oh, I don't like the sound of that last one. Alright, let's try taking out the commandos. Nice! Oh, right, yeah, guaranteed crits. Uh, only 57%, but... Uh, Did that finish him? I guess it did. Alright, I could use the Razzle Dazzle to stop them from doing whatever it is that they're about to do. Yeah, that seems good. Much higher chance to hit the android. Let's go for that. Lots of crits. Mechs coming online. Destroy the control system before they all wake up. Oh. Okay, um... I need androids to shoot at that thing. Uh, this android will go first. Let's go for that. Blowing some fuses. Did some damage. Did it? Nope. I had to try. All right, who's going next? The commando. I could take out the commando. Not taking damage is good. 
But she's also really good at handling the androids. No. Don't let the enemy have a turn. Next time, just shoot. But why shoot and miss when I could just zap? Yeah, Patchwork's abilities are really good. Okay, so... Can I throw a bomb to the other side of the room? No, I cannot get it over there. I have to have him move up. It must be done. Now, can I get a bomb to the other side of the room? I can! It looks like it might do something. Can I hit an android and the thing? No, no, I have to hit the objective. We gotta get damage on that objective right now. Throwing shrapnel. Right in my path. Thanks for that. You're, you're nowhere near that. Close, but still a miss. Okay, now what can you do? I can delay the android. Not until after torque. I don't want to move the purifier. <laughs> How about this android? It won't really move it in the timeline, really, but like... Uh, yeah. Yeah, let's let Torque do something about the android. Now then. The objective. Uh, can I... I cannot bind androids, right. Uh, how much damage will the gun do? A lot. And you have pretty good odds because you're not... Uh... You currently have better cover if you don't move. But the enemy can just move and very easily flank you. Oh, I hate your position. Go here. Okay, now shoot the android. You're dead. So good at critting. Left danger for us. Now what's that guy do? Uh, he's got blast shelter. Oh no. Uh. Uh. Reprogram the mech. Yeah, that would be nice. Only 55% chance. You know what? That's still a coin flip. Let's do it. Marginal as always. It was resisted. Oh, okay. Uh, that'll do a lot of damage to it. I should go after the uh, android. But this will nearly kill it, and then like take out an enemy before it's a problem. Let's do that. Blowing some fuses. A thousand cuts. It's almost down. I don't want to deal with Max. Okay, let's throw another bomb. Uh, if I throw it like, okay, will you be affected if I put it there? Yeah, that looks good. Okay, and now I can shoot the mech. Oh no. Don't like that! Ow. That'll leave a mark. Uh Gross, you're bleeding. How about I put um I have an idea. It's not a very good idea. Let's put the enemy inside of Ready the bomb. Places. It kind of worked. I also gave the enemy cover. Oh, I'm so not smart. On the go. Yeah, just just try. Okay, that was good. 
Well, you took a little bit of damage. Mech Repair Bay seized. Entire Mech Repair Bay hidden beneath these City 31 streets. What other secrets does Sacred Coil keep buried underground? It, it wasn't secret. It was after. Whatever. They're basically the same. They're basically the same. Uh, we only captured two. Mostly because the enemy mostly deployed robots, but also because I kind of killed them with electricity. Oh well. From the archives, Kelly, I need better candidates. Bradford, Caesar Dexcom soldiers aren't good enough? Kelly, they're perfect soldiers, but reclamation agents aren't fighting a war. They're keeping the peace for everyone. Bradford, you expect XCOM soldiers to trust alien squad mates? Just like that. Kelly, John, I struggle with leading the people I used to fight, but I need candidates who accept that the world is changing. Transcript from Reclamation Working Group Meeting, two, uh, 2038, August 24th. And Cherub is done. And we got stuff. If Sacred Coil went after mechs, they need soldiers. But for what army? They were underground until Mayor Nightingale's election drove them to the surface. Their hatred for her gave them motive. Find out if Sacred Coil had the means to carry out an assassination. Okay. Oh, and this is different. Uh, examine fade propaganda. There's a wasting disease affecting some hybrid populations worldwide. It's known locally as the fade. Sacred Oil claims they have a cure. Found out if there's any truth to these broadcasts. Sacred Coil's propaganda is directly adapted from Advent. Their leadership must have a connection. Hmm. Hmm. Have you noticed the growing amount of violence in our city? I have, Gorgo, I have. Makes me wonder if 3-1 PD knows how to do its job. That's a bold statement, Roger. All I'm saying is that it didn't used to be this way. Not when Shrike was keeping the peace. Oh, come on. Mercenaries make bad police. Everyone knows that. Maybe you're right, but at least there was peace. Hmm. She can make poison, so this would give her self-healing. But I do bind the enemy a lot, and this will make sure that my bind stays on. Ah, uh, I really just like binding. Given the way I play, I'm going to take reinforced scales. Ah, uh, let's see. Oh good, sticky grenades, yes! I like that. It does end the turn, but there's nothing stopping you from throwing a concussive grenade and a sticky grenade. Yeah, more bombs. I like bombs. Ah, he just needs more. He just needs more. Ah, she really needs more. Starting from level one is awful. And I'm barely way anywhere into the game. Uh, but I do want to put Cherub back on the team. There's a wasting disease affecting some hybrid populations worldwide. It's known locally as the Fade. Sacred Coil claims they have a cure. Find out if there's any truth to these broadcasts. Oh, so she did read the thing, but I... Okay, it's fine. Uh, let's put Cherub back on the team instead of Claymore, even though Claymore is really good! But I want to use Cherub a little bit, too. Ah, uh, if only I had more spots on my team. If only I could deploy more than four units. But this is the way it is. Alright, so... That means I should have Claymore doing some of this. Which means I won't be able to switch back to him for a little time. But it's better than keeping him... idle. Now, what else can I do? Okay, you're busy, you're still training, that's still going on. I can upgrade some things. Uh, security rank 2, security rank 2, security rank 1, rank 3! Right, this is rank 3. We do have a rank 3 thing. Yeah! We can reduce city anarchy, if we had any. 
We can get extra rewards, but no valid targets. Okay. Hmm. Well, good to know that this lets me know that it works or not. Uh, let's see. What do we want? We'll find out what we want next time on Let's Play XCOM Camara Squad with me, Boltage McGammer. Later, agents!